Creating a bounding box project type is as easy as five different steps. And the first step, we'll just simply name our project up here, and then we'll upload our PDFs or images. You can see the file formats right here that we accept. We can accept multiple files per project. Just know that you can't add files after the project's been created. So after we've uploaded our one or more files for this project, we can go to the next step. Here we'll just simply click none and we'll get a preview of what our project will look like. Then we can skip to step three. And in step three, we want to select bounding box labeling. And then we create our labels, AKA taxonomy that we want applied to the data set. So here I'm going to simply add in a few labels. Uh, we'll make this an NER label set. Then we can add color if we would like. After this, we can select an OCR provider to automatically include the text that our bounding box involves. Step four, we'll go ahead and sign who's going to be a labeler and reviewer for this project. Step five, we can decide whether we want labelers to be able to modify, edit, or add new labels after the project's been created within the labeling interface. At this point, the project is ready to be created. We can simply hit launch project and it will kick us back out to the projects page ready to go back in.